Good morning fellow gamers, here QC Warchief with the Minutemen Legacy. Today in Atlas we are gonna make dice, because as you notice most of my ships are uh, painted. <clears throat> Usually I paint my stuff as well, but uh, I keep losing my armor or my weapons, so it doesn't stay that long. Although I keep my ships as long as possible. So my ship is using black paint. Make it simple, it's black everywhere. No reference to the Black Pearl. I just like the tone black. Uh, so let's start this. Uh, this what this is what's happening when you guys are inactive for around a month inside the game. These are not locked, so don't worry. <laughs> Whenever they spawn inside the game, uh, they'll be able to get out of the gibbet and start playing like the usual. This is just a, a practical prank that we do between us. So let's go. To do dyes, you guys will need simple ingredients. You'll need water and you'll need recipient to put water in. So usually jars or uh, I'm using, personally, I'm using the jar. Uh, but I started to with the gourd, the small water gourd that you can craft with the leather. It's really easy. But so we're going to hold Y. We're going to go into the inventory. And we're, got, we're just going to place those jar there. There we go. And you see that they are filling up with water. So we can take those back. We pull some more. And these are now full. Take those back again. And we need berries. You don't need any particular berries to do this. You just need one berries. So you just put a bunch of berries there. You put your water. And you go on the other side, you select dyes, and you select the color you want. Any berries will do any colors. This is this doesn't matter, and there's a bunch of colors. Although I suggest you to read those, because if you look at the, the, uh, the icon, it doesn't really give you the right... Uh, you see this is red, because red is quite a strong color. It contrasts with the rest. Personally, I, I like the black, so I'm going to take... A bunch of black so I go there I press X and I craft eight but as you can see I cannot craft them at the moment because the fire is not running so I'm gonna have to put some wood out there I must have wood inside that don't need that much there you go you start up the fire with the wood so you place the wood in you start up the fire and whenever the fire is started you have access to the crafting. There you go. It takes a little time. I'm gonna craft eight times five a bottle of paint. So this is how you do paint. I'm gonna let the other one uh, craft by themselves. To paint, you'll need a brush. I believe I have one. Yeah, there you go. Brush that you can make by yourself inside your inventory. I believe it's really easy. You go into the, uh, I believe it's miscellaneous. Yep, the brush is right here. Really easy to make, catch, hide, and wood. So you take your brush, you take your uh, jars of paint, and uh, I need to make an example, which is going to be, yeah, there you go. I'm going to select that. There's only one region to paint on this one. so. There is already paint on my uh, paintbrush, but I'm going to do it anyway. So I paint my brush, and then with my brush, I use the paint to paint regions of the material I want. As example, I'm going to find uh, something to uh, give you a great example. Uh, no, this is not working. I believe this is going to work. There you go. You see there's different regions. So if I'm painting the region 1, I'm going to paint this one. Region 4, I don't see it. Region 6. And you always need to apply the paint. This is the manual way to paint stuff. But there's another way. I kind of love the other one, but it, it doesn't give you any... Um, it's not precise, and I, I guess I'm missing one part of the mechanic to make it precise. So it's the paint gun. You're gonna have to produce it. It's gonna need you gems. You're gonna have to find gems inside the world. Uh, not really hard to find. There is some 
gems inside Blackwood. Uh, so it's quite easy to find those. And at the moment, you see that I don't have any paint. So I'm going to have to go in my inventory, select the paint, and affect it to my paint gun. Deselecting my paint gun, and uh, I believe, yeah, I'm going to do this one. I'm going to paint the whole roof here and show you how it's done and how fast it does. Oh, you must be kidding. Oh, there you go. There you go. You don't see a big difference right now, but you still see that I'm painting the whole thing and it doesn't take me that much. There you go. This is way shorter. I'm gonna do the other one real quick because I like uh, stuff that looks nice. I'll try to make it uniform at least. There you go looks a little better because it's darker. So, boing. And finally, with the paint, you can paint uh, all your ship parts also. It goes with it. Uh, every little things that you can paint inside the, the world uh, will use pretty much the same mechanic. At the moment, if I, it's a good thing because I don't have my armor painted. So I'm going to paint up my armor. I take the jar of paint, I go on my armor directly and I'm gonna sta stabilize this because I don't like it turn and there you go, not this one, not this one either, this one, this one, and this one, there you go. So you see I painted the, the whole thing, I'm gonna go on my pants, that's gonna make a better job. Oh, just remove those pants. And you can do these with guns also. Uh, this is something that is really nice because you can literally customize everything inside the game. This is something that I really like. Although, like I said, you tend to lose your stuff on a regular basis inside the game. So uh, it takes a little time to customize everything. You, depending on what you're doing, you may not want to lose that much time into the customization. And there we go, I'm about to be done here. At least gonna try to finish the whole thing. Is it this one? There you go, this one. And uh, essentially I'm just recovering the letter. There we go. Easy to do. Look, looks nice with black. We don't have any uh, uniformity inside the, the, the community. You choose the color you want it won't it won't matter Whoa. there you go so this has been a pleasure guys please subscribe i'll keep doing these videos today it was paint job eventually i'm gonna circle all the ships and go with the spec how i personally prefer to use those so have a good one guys this is qc war chief i hope to see you soon in atlas with the minuteman legacy we have a lot of fun here uh, the more we sail together, the better we get, and it's getting better every day. It's really an awesome game. So have fun, guys. Please subscribe. Please like. This is QC War Chief along the Minutemen Legacy. We're having fun in Atlas. I hope you guys do as well. Yeah.